Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Dollar Tree is starting to put out all of their new inventory for Easter and spring, so I'm taking you with me so we can check it all out together. But before we get started, if you are new here, please do consider subscribing down below. I have a lot of spring and Easter inspired DIYs on the way very soon. Here we are at my local Dollar Tree. And one of the first things I noticed as soon as I walked in were their new signs for Easter and spring. So I must say, I think they did an excellent job with their signs this year. Very large, really nice quality, and the images are beautiful. So a standout piece for me this year was definitely this really large egg sign. I think that it just has such a beautiful design to it. And the thing that really makes it pop is that extra detail of the galvanized rabbit on it. Another one of my favorites were these little rabbit signs here. They're just super cute, but they also do have some really nice details. So I loved this one. I loved how she was holding a little banner that actually is burlap and says the word spring on it. Over here, we have a couple different inspirational ones, really pretty images on these. And I think that these are really great for DIYs. They also had this really adorable carrot patch sign and I definitely did pick this one up. I have a really fun DIY planned for it. And they also had this one with the cottontail farms with the pink truck. So over here, they had some wood Easter baskets and these ones actually have a little initial in them. So really great for customizing, fun for a DIY. I did pass up on this one, but I do think they're really cute. If you've been here before, you might have heard me rave about the holiday doormats from Dollar Tree. I'm a huge fan of these. They're very thin, but for the price, they are so pretty and they really do hold up well outside. They also had these metal rabbits that are perfect to go in your garden or maybe just in a bouquet of flowers or in your potted plant. Really cute. They also had some tinsel here. They had pink, yellow, and blue. The pink ones and the blue ones had little Easter bunnies. The yellow one had little chicks. These would be really fun in a child's Easter basket. Also, I'm a huge fan of the window clings from Dollar Tree. They're so fun to decorate mirrors or just windows, of course, but they also make really pretty images for DIYs. And you can just add a little bit of Mod Podge and add it to a wood piece or a whole bunch of different things. And for $1.25, you have some really nice pictures. These egg picks are definitely a fan favorite every year. These are perfect for DIY crafts and also for making an Easter or spring wreath. Really pretty and you get a couple different ones in a pack depending on the size. They also had this Peeps flavored lip balm. I figured I would just show it to you in case you happen to see it and think that someone might enjoy it. And over here, this is one of my favorite sections. I love the crafter square area, especially the seasonal ones. So I did pick up a couple of these here. So these are their wood eggs. You guys might remember they had something similar for Valentine's Day. They had the wood hearts and I really, really loved those. So I did go ahead and pick up a couple of this bunny shaped head as well as the eggs. Another seasonal item that they usually always carry is this paint your own ornament kit. Really, really sweet for an Easter basket. I think this would be such a fun gift for somebody. New find for me this year were the Crafter Square foam characters. So they had a large foam rabbit. They also had eight little mini rabbits in a pack as well as some mini eggs or the larger eggs. So these might have been around last year, but I don't remember seeing them. And I think that these are really great for a DIY. Over here, we also had some really, really pretty rabbit picks. And this one was another one of my favorite finds. I definitely picked that up for a fun DIY. So stay tuned for that one. And that will be out very soon. Over here, they had some little mini egg ornaments and these plastic golden eggs. So last year I got the pastel version of these where you get six in a pack just like this. And I was on the hunt for those. Sadly, did not find them at this Dollar Tree, but I did end up finding them later on. They also had a bunch of plush animals and their floral selection was very well stocked. So I did pick up quite a bit of these faux florals for some crafts and also just to make some really fun, pretty floral arrangements for Easter. 
Next up is actually another Dollar Tree that I went to and they did have some of the same stuff but they also had some newer things that I did not see at the previous Dollar Tree. So they had these pom-poms that come in a large pack here. They had a couple different sizes and those are perfect if you are looking for a rabbit tail for a DIY. And I did find one pack of those pastel eggs that I was looking for, so I was quite happy to find those. They also had more of these color your own ornaments, just like the other Dollar Tree. They did have a much larger selection of wood craft signs, so I was pretty excited to see those. So these are some of the different ones, really fun to paint. They also had these little mini ornaments. These are great to add small embellishments to a DIY project, and they also had this a large rabbit sign, as well as the tail end of a bunny, and this little wooden chick. These arrow signs would be great to turn into a yard sign, and they also had some galvanized metal signs as well. Over here, you can kind of see them peeking out the side. Here they are. They had these signs here, but instead of the natural wood, they kind of had a white wood finish to them, so those were really different and fun to see. And they also had these little ornament decorations that kind of turned the letter into a bunny, so I thought that those were pretty fun. A lot of the new wreath forms were still missing, but they did have this rabbit head one, and they also had a different variety of the doormat. So in addition to the pickup truck, they had one that said Happy Easter. Over here, they have some gnome signs, so it was fun to see that they continued on with their gnome theme. They've been bringing them out for almost every holiday, and I know there are so many gnome fans on this channel. Over here was a really pretty welcome sign. And then one of the last things that I checked out were some of their Easter eggs. So I don't really buy these too often, but of course, if you are creating an Easter basket for someone, this is definitely a great place to stock up on some fun and different eggs that you can fill up with some jelly beans or different candies. I was really impressed with the variety and just kind of the more unique shapes that I saw here. So I thought that the little chick ones and the carrots were so adorable, but that pickup truck was definitely a new one for me. I have never seen an Easter egg like that before. So they definitely have a different shape or style to suit anyone's needs. Thank you guys so much for coming to Dollar Tree with me. I hope that you had as much fun as I did checking out all of the new inventory. If you're new here and not yet subscribed, please do consider subscribing. You can click my picture right here. And be sure to check out this video for some more crafting fun.